What's going on guys, Prentice P here, back with another reaction video, and we're going to be heading back into the realm of Netflix for Marvel, and we're going to be doing Jessica Jones Season 2 trailer. Now, um, with Jessica Jones, I watched Season 1, and I like the story of Jessica Jones, because it kind of felt like she was trying to get back at Kilgrave after everything she's been through, along with trying to to solve a murder that Kilgrave had on this girl that she had control of. And this girl that she had control of ended up killing her parents. And with her killing her parents, she was put in jail. And Jessica Jones wanted to try to find a way to, you know, get her out of jail because of Kilgrave. And I, I was really getting into it. I really did. I was really enjoying what I was watching. And... And I get some of the criticism that Jessica Jones gets with, like, you know, not being as action-paced as Daredevil was around the time, because it was just Daredevil and um, Jessica Jones that had came out. And so, but I understand why they did that, because, again, this was Marvel's version of Alias. It was mostly based on being a detective, finding clues, solving the mystery, getting into the suspense of figuring out, like, how she's going to try to, like, figure this out. And to me, I kind of look at it as sort of an adult version of Scooby-Doo. Not with the ghost and shit, but just more of, like, really being taken more seriously. And, yeah, there was a bit of humor, but to a big degree, it was pretty serious on just with the tone and the stuff that they brought in and how explicit it was, because it's really explicit in the comics. And so... I really supported her story, and I really liked her story. The character, probably not much, but, you know, I still, like, enjoy the character overall. Might not be one of my favorites, but I can still appreciate what they did. And again, I understand why people kind of was like, eh, on Jessica Jones, because she was probably the most unknown. She's more of the unknown out of all of the um characters in the Defenders compared to, like, Daredevil, Luke Cage, Iron Fist, because, you know, who was Jessica Jones? Because I don't think a lot of people even knew who Jessica Jones was. Hell, I didn't know who Jessica Jones was. Because the first time I knew of her was from the Marvel Netflix shows. So, that was my introduction to her. So, I'm glad that what they did, I appreciate what they did for her. I might not be fully on with the character itself, but the story that she went through, I can support that because that can happen to people in real life and so we're gonna react to this trailer to the season two official trailer i have not watched this at all and i'm going to do my best to kind of like you know not say too much i'm just gonna watch it and just sit here watch it with you guys and just live the reaction of a not so much of a reactor <laughs> towards this video so here we go Third glass tonight. Put it on my tab. Drinking to remember or forget? Giving a shit won't get you a better tip. <laughs> I was feeling sad. Can't help looking back. Highway. My whole family was killed in a car accident. Someone did horrific experiments on me. And now this super vigilante shit keeps coming at me. Do you know Captain America? I want to absorb Ailey's investigations. You don't want me, you just want to eliminate the competition. I never take no for an answer. How rapey of you. Something happened behind these doors. I have 17 years of questions, and they are deep. Just knowing what was done to you might help you. We were made here. Me and something else. The only way to find it is to open the door wider. You were brought back from the dead. The powers were a side effect. How many others are there? Like me. Let it go. There is a killer you cannot control. I didn't ask for any of this. Jessica might not want a sidekick, but she needs one. You're not super. You're ticking time off. Keep telling me who I am. How dare you? What if facing it makes me worse? 
What are you gonna do? I don't know. Depends on if I can get through this night without losing my shit. Touch the Jones! It takes a monster to stop a monster. What did they do to us? Okay, all right. So it seems like this season of Jessica Jones season two, it was kind of brought up a bit of just really of her getting the powers that she has. And with her getting the powers that she has, she's going to try to find out more about herself and like her accident that she went through so many years ago when she was a kid. And so, like, yeah, we're going to be getting the gist of it. We really are going to be getting the gist of it a lot more with how she got the powers. And it seems like Trish is also going to be involved, too, because it seems like she's going to be fighting as well, because she did a bit of fighting in season one, which I liked. And, you know, she was like a cool character. She was kind of like another half of Jessica Jones <laughs> to me. And I'm definitely like, all right. All right. I definitely want to learn more to see, like, what makes her her. What is making her her just by... um. You know, with these abilities that she has. And, yeah, I'm definitely intrigued by it. I definitely want to see where it goes, how long it's going to take for it to get to that point. And just to see if there's going to be any cameos by, not just by the people that we saw, but we saw Hogarth, we saw Trish. Um, I'll see if we see, like, Luke Cage or anything, because that was another thing. Like, we didn't see Luke Cage at all, because we all know in the comics that... Jessica Jones and Luke Cage have a very big connection towards each other, but we don't know. Probably will, probably not. And part of me kind of doesn't want it because I think it's just her story, and um, I don't know. I, I don't think I really want it. But if it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, I'm cool with that too. But yeah, it was a pretty good trailer. Really insight on what she's gonna be doing and how it's gonna go and. Yeah, I'm definitely, definitely interested in seeing where it goes. Not the reaction I guess you guys wanted, because I'm not like, oh my god, like, nah, like, I'm just watching just to watch, because, you know, I just want to see where it goes, where it takes her, and see how far she can get through her journey, and that's what I want from her.